Hello YouTube and welcome to a tutorial video. Ooh, something different. Kind of. I've actually done this tutorial before, but that was years ago. And I didn't like it, so I took it down. But today, two years later, I'm redoing it. I said I would do it two years ago, the redoing. That didn't happen. I apologize. What I'm going to be teaching you how to install today is the no ice melt and no fire spread mods for Minecraft Forge. Because lots of people have issues installing this, and I did too until I managed to teach myself how. So, the first thing you'll want to do is go to this website, which is the mod developer, Soccer Guy 3. It's uh, the Minecraft forum page for the mod. And obviously, you're going to want to download it. Uh, that'll be here, it says downloads. So, you'll click on this and this, depending on if you want the ice melt or the fire spread versions. Uh, and that's for 1.11.2. Currently, it will be updated, and there are older versions. Uh, down. Uh, so you'll just want to go download that, so let's just download this quickly to show you what to do. It'll take you to a OneDrive page, and then you will select No Fire Ice Melt there, and then you'll choose your version. So I'm not going to be using 1.11.2, I'm going to be using 1.7.2, because that's my favorite version of Minecraft. And you'll don't click this one, because this one's the source, unless you want it. Uh, but these ones are the actual files you'll be using, so you can just download that one, or that one, and yada yada yada. Then once you have those downloaded, I've already got mine in these file, uh, in this file, so, sorry. Uh, you'll want to head to your Minecraft installation folder, which will be in the, uh, this, um, don't know what to call it, but it'll be in your users file, uh, so mine is hollow, then app data, roaming, and dot Minecraft. Um, and then you'll go to your versions and then for whatever version of the mod you downloaded you'll go to that version of forge so i've got mine are 1.7.2 so i'll go to the forge 1.7.2 folder here and then you'll take this dot jar file not the dot json file just the dot jar you'll right click open with winrar archiver okay once you've done that you'll go to your mods you'll open them and then you'll just take this file and drag it into the um, the jar file for the game so you'll just drag them in there and then the ice mod you'll just drag it in and then one of the most important steps you have to delete the meta oops sorry you have to delete the meta in folder in the .jar file for the game. So you have to delete that or else it won't work. Okay, once you've done that, you open Minecraft. Uh, since the game got updated, this is the new launcher. Uh, you'll go to Launch Options. You'll select your Forge version or create a new one. If You can do whatever you want. I'm just gonna use the already existing Forge one. Uh, make sure you're using Java 7 because Forge, uh, the 1.7 versions of Forge don't work with Java 8, so I'm just going to change it quickly. Uh, Java bin Java. Okay. And then you'll right, uh, sorry, left click on that box so that you can alter the JVM arguments. You'll go back to the page where you downloaded the mod and you will copy this, which I will put in the description along with the link to this website. So you have to copy that. And then after where it says uh, slash, well, sorry, half an XMX1G, you'll start, you'll uh, go there, you'll press a space, and then you'll paste the thing you copied from Minecraft forums, save, and that should be it. And then you can start your game up, and let's test it out. All right, so I've uh, loaded up my world um, I've already got this set up so I'm just gonna put some fire there and see if this fire spreads or this ice melts it does not appear to be I think it would have melted by this point let's just wait for a bit longer I'll speed it up so you guys don't have to watch it the, 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 the smart sounding word 
Um, yes. It went out. Okay. So yeah, it's working. Hundred percent. So that's that's how you install it. That's all you have to do. That's literally all you have to do. It's actually quite simple. So um, I hope you guys know what to do now. I hope you guys know how to install the mod. I hope this helped you out. And if you're still having troubles, please don't ask me. I know nothing about modding. My dogs are at the door. About modding um, with Java. Please ask the developer of the mods. He'll know what to do. He'll most likely be able to help you. Uh, so uh, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all next time.